day 28 and we're pulling out all the flutes for this one this one's titled the villager say i should visit the wise sage on the hill we're right here toward the end and i thought what better uh our villager is in this little village now he's been talking he's been relaxing and what better way to um, capture one of these closing tracks uh, as the story re reaches its crescendo than to incorporate both uh, both ocarinas, bass and alto. So we have bass, uh, the bigger one, you know. And then that was in track six or seven, track, no, track five, the one with the campfire and crackly sounds. And then, of course... This is the one that's been used in most everything. Um, and I really wanted to bring the ocarina back around toward the end here because I knew it probably wouldn't fit too much in the next tracks to come. And then, of course, Tin Whistle. That has been a pretty prevalent uh, instrument in the last, oh, 10 tracks or so. And so I wanted to try to incorporate all three of those elements. I'm almost throwing it uh, together to create almost like a harmonious spirit kind of sound. So this is where our protagonist realizes that, hey, the answer that he is looking for uh, could possibly be found by this wise gentleman who lives on the hillside within the outskirts of the town. And the villagers have told him, you should probably go there and talk to this guy. So this is track 28. Let's take a listen. say i should see the wise man on the hill 
like I said, I wanted to kind of incorporate a harmonious spirit in this one. I wanted to make it feel as if everything is coming together. And so the flutes and the, I guess all of the more flute woodwind type sounds have been representative of spirit through this entire album or soul or heart, whatever you want to say. Uh, maybe a combination of all three of those things. And so I wanted to bring all three of them together where they all had their own little piece to play and then came together in harmony and began to sing together. So it was no more uh, no more of the the shifting, no more one or the other. It was harmoni uh, harm harmonious and carried forward to represent this journey kind of getting an answer. Uh, we may not know what that answer is yet, but we can feel that it's on the precipice of something. And so this town obviously is kind of where this answer will be found. There's going to be something happen here, and I'm really excited for the ending of this. So I think that's all I'm going to say on this one because we're getting kind of close to the end on all of this. Uh, and I'm just going to leave the rest of it for mystery for tomorrow and the day after. But with that being said, if you would ever so kindly subscribe to this YouTube channel, and if you haven't done so so far, uh, find me on TikTok and on Instagram, and let me know what you think about this track in the comments section below. We'll see you tomorrow for day 29 as this thing uh, ramps up to the end here.